Hi, this is Ellen from Blackbaud. In this video, we're going to take a look at some of the enhancements we made to the GL Distributions tab in this release. Let's go to the GL Distributions tab for a payment. The GL Distributions tab now displays a timeline that shows original payment transactions as well as activity associated with the original transaction, such as adjustments. For example, if you adjust a payment, the timeline displays the original payment and the adjustment. All transactions in the timeline are listed by post date. Only posted and not posted distributions display on the tab. In the timeline, under Transaction History by Post Date, you can click each transaction date separately, or you can click All Dates to view transaction activity for all dates associated with the original transaction. Use the View filter to further specify the types of distributions to display. If an alias exists for a transaction, the alias displays in the account column instead of the account number. The account alias associates the account number in the system with the account number in your third-party general ledger system. If a transaction was entered using an enhanced revenue batch, the batch number displays in the batch number column. The mapping type column displays the type of revenue transaction, such as gift stock. Distribution types are now separated by headers that reflect the distribution's application type. We also removed the term GL distributions from each header. For example, sold stock GL distributions now appears as sold stock. Colored arrows display beside each row indicating current and reversal activity. Green signifies current distributions, orange signifies distributions that have been reversed, and red signifies reversal distributions. Previously, reversal transactions were listed in a separate grid. With this release, reversal activity now displays under the header of the original transaction. Reversal displays under the reference column. We also changed the way you edit distributions. You can now click Edit next to a distribution header. When you edit payment and order distributions, you can only edit the account and reference fields. You edit transaction type and amount information directly from the transaction record. That's all for now. Thanks for watching.